Mechanica and Master Mummy characters that you can really, you can see in top eight here, you know, Evo Japan. So very exciting. I think we're gonna have our next match starting right right now. Yeah. Actually, it's gonna be Malie versus Gore. We're gonna do the matches out of order a little bit. That's fine. You know, Gore's gonna stay where he was, honestly. <laughs> Whew, here we go. And the Gore rocking that double toaster. Meanwhile, uh, looks like Malie using that double fun chuck. Oh man, that double toaster, I, I love it. It's such a great counter pick right there. It's kind of just trying to get those knockdowns immediately after charge. Oof, but Malie, incessant stun right here from the punch up. And I like that a small little juggle too afterwards. You say there are no combos in arms, but my goodness, man, that round went by in the blink of an eye. Dude. So close to what? perfect, which we saw in the last game when Gore was playing, which is so rare. No one perfects Gore, you know? Yeah, what are these big body characters doing? These people right now are putting Gore on notice. They're like, see me offline, Gore. All right, he's going to switch back to that double buff. Fast one. 245 quick damage. Oh my gosh, it just. Oh, Dude, these guys is, are clanking. They don't, they're incessantly. Bro, this is like, I don't know if the first time you ever played Punch Out, you just throw out the punches. You have no idea what your opponent is trying to do to you. You're just trying, you're trying to throw out punches. Faster than the other opponent right now. <laughs> That's what you're seeing here. Yes, yeah, this is like Wii Boxing. Yup, yup. <laughs> but none of these guys right now are using motion controls. Here it so is. So Gore with a huge life lead here starting off the second round. Looking a lot better than round number one for him. We do see Malib with that rush. Probably got to hold on to it until the, until the third round because yeah. I don't think she's going to be able to run this one back. But we have seen her do it before, so who knows? Pressure right now, Malib. She doesn't want to get grabbed right there, which is why you saw both of those punch ups coming out. But with both of those punch ups coming out like that, isn't that a little bit risky? It is a little bit, but I don't think... Uh, I think she knows that Gore is probably not going to pop his rush. He's going to want to save his rush this, the third round as uh, well. A bait. Okay. Okay, now actually staggering both of them. Gore. Things are getting a little scary though for Gore. Gore's still sitting on it. He's like, you know what? All right, Malib, you could you could keep your meter. I'll keep mine as well. <laughs> All right. Oh, early grab coming off from Gore. It's going to connect too because honestly, Mechanic has a really hard time. She's already hovering towards the one side. That grab will always connect unless her, her punch is already out, man. Opportunity right there and. So much damage, 225, decent enough, too. Yeah. You see those, uh, that those buff punches coming out over and over, building as much meter as possible in a short amount of time. Malib trying to fight back with his punch chucks going around. Uh, has to slap a manner, too, realizing those buffs uh, only, you know, they only, generally only go forward, slow slap a manner is going to help get past. Scary situation right here, but instead, whoa! Wow. I love those. Deep. I love those errant grabs that just kind of come out sometimes where you wouldn't expect to grab. Or having a little fun out there with Helix. Oh, I thought it was a bait. He won. It was all a ruse. It was all a ruse. Gore Magala, <laughs> right there. Not even afraid of the slap commander being a great counter pick for his character. It's like, yeah, I know this character can contort his body in so many different ways, move around the left and right, <laughs> up and down. I in think and he out. was trying to bait out the slap commander coming. <laughs> <laughs> he was matter. just dancing in front of her, man. Didn't even matter. Didn't even matter. Probably believe will be uh, bringing it back as it does do a good job of dealing, uh, putting a work against this particular character. Here we go, Malieve. Mechanica, love this character. Everyone is able to just bring their own custom loadouts. It's a beautiful day. Fun sucks. Out game. here again at the lab, dude. Yeah, game number two on DNA Lab. Interesting kind of pick here from Malieve. Uh, I, I guess she's going to try to use uh, those, those pillars to, to get, to, you know, not have to worry about the, the, the buffs as much. But they're, they're still coming out, man. She's not using the pillars. All right, there we go. Finally behind one. Just chilling right now. I don't think Gore cares, though. I think he's going to keep punching. Yeah, Gore, Gore's fine. If anything, Gore's going to look for those opportunities to Make extend himself while he stands, right? So he could probably get that charge. Same thing with the crouch, right? When you go for the crouch dash. Oh, they're just, dude, they're just going in. Rush, rush, pop, double pop, just throwing out as many punches. Who, who's going to win, man? You, you never know. Whoever wins, whoever has the lose. most health, you know? <laughs> and look at that. That, that's, that person is Gormagala. Uh, less than 250 health. As you can see, red health already. Scary situation here for Malie. I think the really funny thing is that Gore doesn't even care. These punches are not flinching. Believe he just just wants the meter. He just wants the damage. That's man. It. it. No no knockdowns. No flinches. Just keep punching. One thing for people to know: uh, if you do get an attack on an opponent that uh, doesn't flinch, you deal 50% less damage. Mm -hmm. So you're gonna have to put in a little extra work. And this is why you see the grab come out the moment the character said uh, announces it. Arms. You know, I, I wish it was uh, Biff that said arms. 
That'd be dope. <laughs> Just saying. On <laughs> All right. All right, new play. <laughs> Have a little bit too much fun with the uh, the lore. Let's go, Ben. But here it is, Gromagalo with the solid movement, and I believe DC we have a different arm on the field. Yeah, uh, looks like uh, looks like Bleed using that lockjaw. Ah, actually, rarely see that use. Yeah, this is uh, one of Doctor Coil's arms. Very very goofy arm has a has an explosion attribute. Oh, and right there you notice, uh, believe actually using the right arm first. Because I guess there might be startup regardless. Yeah. The rush right there to the face. And Gore, honestly, I'll be honest, Gore just cleaned that one up. The punches were flying. Malib did not have an answer for it at all. Trying her best, but unfortunately falls here to Gore, and Gore will move on. That was immediately Gore Magala with the buffered respect hug. <laughs> he was ready. He right? was ready. He's he like, was right. ready. Headset was already <laughs> down before the camera was on him. And, and they're like, Gore Magala. Oh, they got a group hug oh, at the crowd too, man. Players, regardless of who has fallen in battle, you know, so you know I think it is. They're like, all right, guys, we just got to make sure it's not an all Japanese yeah. grand final. That's <laughs> all right, it. Gore, just, just do it. Just do us, just do us, do it, Gore. They're all fellows in arms. What a beautiful, what a beautiful day. That's, that's a great name, too, I think. Fellows in arms. Good, good play on Mark. I like it. I like okay. it. Right. But in any case, Gore will move on to losers' finals. We'll fight. The loser of Pega versus Sakura. Or, I'm sorry, Sukura. Sukura, I'm sorry, Sukura, Sukura. I've been playing too much Street Fighter AE, man. Sakura. Sukura. You like Sakura? You're, are you playing Sakura now? Oh, yeah, I'm a Sakura player. Really? <laughs> I you, love that character. Yesterday I was at Sky Studio and I saw some sick Sakura play from Kendevu. Really? Yeah. 